Pop quiz, gents. What's the one piece of clothing that if you wear this, you're gonna look taller, stronger, leaner, more masculine? Seriously, gents, if you're 40 pounds overweight, this is gonna help to slim up your silhouette. If you're skinny, if you wanna look more muscular, this is gonna help to build up your profile. So what piece of clothing am I talking about? Gents, find out in today's video. <laughs> All right, gents, without further ado, the one item any man can put on and start to look amazing immediately is a jacket. All right, so at this point, you may be saying, okay, Antonio, that sounds nice, that sounds simple, but why? Why does a jacket make any man look amazing? Well, I've got five reasons. Reason number one, a jacket makes you look amazing, it builds up the shoulders. Let's talk about in structured jackets, sports jackets, blazers, suits. We're gonna find there's a bit of padding here in the shoulders, and we've got a shoulder point. That point is something that the eyes pick up on. When you just wear a t-shirt, when you just wear a shirt that naturally conforms to the shoulders, unless you've got really built shoulders, you spend a lot of time in the gym, it's not going to look like your shoulders are being built up. Versus when you wear this jacket, we get a point there. That point is a natural draw to the eye and it makes you just look a little bit wider, a little bit heavier, a little bit thicker at the shoulder area. Now, the buildup of the shoulders matters because when you're measuring somebody up, when you're determining the height and size of a man, you oftentimes use the shoulders as one of those really quick references to make a split second decision. Here's the thing, whenever a man is wearing a jacket, people are gonna perceive him to be taller, one to two inches on average, and they're gonna perceive him to be more muscular and stronger. Now, this takes us to the second point of why a jacket makes you look amazing is it helps to shape the torso into a natural V. So, on all these jackets, structured jackets I talked about here, sports jackets, blazers, suits, we have a button that whenever you stand, you wanna make sure that you button that one button, and what does it do? It creates a V. The same thing right here on this suede jacket. I can actually zip it in a way so that I get just that bottom area right in here, and all of a sudden, I've got this V shape right here in the chest. This right here, even if you're carrying a little bit of extra weight around the midsection, is going to give you a slimmer look. It's gonna give you that classic V, something that women look at, that other men look at, to be able to identify a healthy viral male. Now, gents, if you're looking for a jacket that has all these characteristics, a jacket that when you wear it, it's going to make you look like a badass, a jacket like this maroon suede right here, you need to check out my project over with J.R. Rocha. So the inspiration for these jackets is the classic Moto Racer. You're going to notice we've got that really nice hardware, that zipper right there in the front, which has the unique feature that you can basically pull the zipper up to the midpoint and it'll just look great. This is a limited run. We're making $1,500 jackets and we're selling them for a fraction of that price. I need your help. You're going to pre-order these jackets, then we're going to make them. That's going to enable us to not carry any inventory and to reduce our risk of making a whole bunch of jackets that nobody would buy. Although I have been working with a lot of you guys. I've got hundreds of you guys on my email list that have told me, hey, I'm interested in this. So based off of your votes, we're going with these three beautiful colors, the maroon, the light tan, and the gray. Use that link down in the description of today's video to go over and check it out. This is something I'm really proud of. Again, these are pre-orders. And so if you've been interested, don't wait on the fence. Go grab your jacket. We do have a limit. We ask that you don't purchase more than three jackets. I know some of you guys are gonna wanna get one of each of the really, I mean, just beautiful colors. I've got all these jackets, absolutely love them. And uh, yeah, I can't wait for you guys to grab them. Now, really quick, gents, if women ask you for style advice, go ahead and smash that like button. Now, this next point, really important, and to be honest, most guys have no idea that this is even something they should be looking for in a quality jacket, and that is make sure that it's got a small arms eye. That is also known as an armhole. It's basically where the sleeve is attached to the torso of the jacket. Now, most manufacturers, they're gonna make this hole large. Why? Because they want it to fit as many body types as possible. And a lot of guys think, okay, a large armhole, well, that's gonna give me more room to move, right? So that sounds more comfortable. Not true. Think of it like jeans. If you had jeans with a really low cut crotch, basically it's going to make your legs look short and you're going to you know, not be able to run. Your legs are not going to be able to move. The reality, gents, is the better it fits around the armpit area, around the shoulders, the smaller that arm size is, 
and the better it fits your body there, the overall fit of the jacket is just gonna look better. When you raise your arms up, you're gonna have more freedom of movement. Now, dovetailing off the size of the arm side, let's talk about the cut of the sleeve. For the vast majority of men, we want a nice, slim cut sleeve. You want a nice taper that goes right here all the way down to the cuff so that when you put your hands through, they just barely go through. If you've got an oversized cuff, if you have an oversized sleeve, it's just gonna make your arms look stubby, it's gonna make your hands look smaller, not a great look. You wanna go for something that fits your silhouette and overall fits the body. And this is key, I don't know why manufacturers don't pay more attention to the cut right here of the sleeve. To me, it's one of the most critical parts of the aspects, the overall look of the jacket when you put it on. The next key thing you need to pay attention to is jacket length. Very important to proportions, especially if you're five foot four or you're six foot four, you're taller or you're shorter than average. You need to understand that jacket length will can kind of exaggerate that. So if you're a shorter man in general, you want to go for shorter jackets. If you're a taller man in general, you want to go for slightly longer jackets. Now, certain jacket styles, they are going to fit in a certain way. Sports jackets, blazer jackets, suit jackets. These are made to fit right down there at the curvature of the buttocks. So they're going to go about you know, what, five to six inches below your waistline. When it comes to a suede jacket, a leather jacket, a shirt jacket, these are oftentimes made to be cut higher right at the waistline. Now, if you're a smaller guy, shorter guy, you want to make sure that you're going with a jacket that is right there at that point or maybe a little bit shorter. So when it goes to you know find a nice suede jacket, you want to make sure it's cut right there at the waistline, maybe going an inch below. Low. If you're six foot four, guess what? You can go longer. You can have it go two to three inches below the waistline when you're looking at a suede jacket, when you're looking at a leather jacket. When you're looking at your suit jackets as a taller man, it's okay if it goes one inch below the curvature of your buttocks. But if you're a shorter guy, you do not want that to happen. You would rather go with a shorter cut. Thankfully, a lot of modern cuts are actually made to be shorter. Not thankfully, if you're a tall guy, you're finding that a lot of the cuts, just something looks off. And that's the key is we're trying to maintain the proportions because as a shorter man, you don't want to look any shorter. As a taller guy, you don't want to look like a giant. In summary, pay attention to the length of the jacket. Understand the styles and the different lengths needed there and your own height and how it can affect the look of your proportions. Now, this next point is an easy way to look amazing in a jacket, but so many men drop the ball here and that is go with a unique fabric, a unique material, a unique pattern. If you already like sports jackets and you own one in a classic gray, then go look at some of the other colors. I'm not saying blues and blacks. I am saying, hey, if you wear that jacket, you like it, maybe go for a bolder pattern. When it comes to leather jackets, yes, you can go with a black leather jacket, just like any other guy out there. And that may be your go-to. But if you're wearing it and you like it, maybe try going with the suede right here in maroon. Seriously, gents, it's such an easy way to upgrade your look, to go with a fabric that sets you apart from the crowd. One maybe that has a unique color, a drape, a texture that people want to get in close, people want to touch. All right, gents, so what video to watch next? How about my ultimate guide to the leather jacket. If you've got any questions, you want to know how to buy a leather jacket, I've got you covered in this video right here.